Find the volume of a cone with the radius of 3. <clears throat> okay. And we're going to use 3.14 as pi. So, let's look at the formula for the volume of a cone. Volume of a cone would be pi r squared times the height. Then we're going to divide that all by 3. <coughs> Let's see how this turns out. We got pi, which is 3.14 times the radius, which it told us is 3. We're going to square that. Oh, it didn't give us the height? Yeah, we'll say the height is 5 then. That's all right. <laughs> Process is still the same. Then we'll divide this all by 3. There we go. Now we can see that. So, uh, working this out, exponents first. We got 3.14 times, that would be 3 times 3, which is 9, times the height, which we just said is 5. And now we can multiply. <clears throat> Actually, before we multiply, just because we have that decimal, I'm going to simplify first. I can take that 9 and divide it by 3, which is just 3. That gives me a whole new expression, though, 3.14 times 3 times 5. Is that okay? Well, let's multiply then from left to right. What is that? 9 point... Is that 12, 3, 4, 9.42? times this 5, so is that a 10, 1, no, 42.1, let me just double check that, so we have 42.1, 42 and 5, 10, 21, yeah, 2, yeah, oh, 47, what the heck. I don't know, maybe that's a good save. 47.10. And also, the label, that didn't tell us what that units was, so we'll just put units. It'd be cubic units, if you want. 